Well, I was really very pleased that the girls came back uh, in good shape. Freshmen typically are all going to come in shape because they're scared. They don't know what to expect. Uh, the returners, uh, there were spot, their spots open, you know, and so they, if they want to win that spot, they need to come ready. And with two a days and three a days, if you're if you're sore and that's going to hinder you, that's tough. You know this was coming. So the kids that were ded are dedicated, and I'm and pleasantly pleased with how everybody came in shape and we were able to get a lot of work done. I mean, the, we have had a, you know, a really good rivalry with Salisbury and uh, have played them three times over the last two years. So two years ago we played them twice and they just happened to be at the same tournament. So last year we played them once and did not play well. Uh, so we definitely will be ready for Salisbury. Uh, the girls look forward to that. They know a, a lot about each other and some of them are, were good friends in high school. So they're really looking forward to playing Salisbury uh, over the weekend. And we know we had the target on the back, but we really don't talk about it at all. In fact, we're talking less about winning and more about team chemistry and bonding this year than, than anything. And any, and any other year, I think we re need to reestablish our culture when we've, we've had some leaders graduate uh, and reestablish our, our culture and how we're going to treat each other and how we're, um, what is it that's important to us, our core, core values as a team, and how we want to compete together as a team are the two of the things that we really have talked a lot about. Just like last year, if we can get that win against Messiah, it puts us in good position for the rest of the season. Messiah, uh, we think, is going to be one of the top teams in the uh, conference again, and you, you always would like to get that first conference win. When you have a second team All-American returning, Anna, and everybody knows Annika uh, Swartz, so of course, and she is a huge part of our uh, offense and our team and our passing and our defense. So, uh, and Mariah Savage, who was honorable mention All-American last year, she looks very good in practice. And, uh, you know, Victoria Prokick um, will be back, and she was honorable mention All-Conference last year, but uh, I think after she got that freshman year under her belt, I'm looking for her to do a lot of things. There's so, there's so many, Joe. You know, Katie Leffridge came in in fantastic shape, and she you know, is really stepping up uh, to help us in that outside position. And Chelsea Ireland and, El and Lauren Jan look really, really good in the middle. And we've got three setters that are really competing to see who's going to set this year. And so that's yet to be decided. So there is, you know, and, and then there's Lauren Weaver, you know, another, another a senior right side. So there are so many, uh, which, is, which is part of our success. It, it, you know, if Annika's not having a good day, it's okay. You know, we've got a, a lot of other people that can step up, and that's the strength of our team. Now, I didn't even mention our Labar, you know, Diana Bradbury was honorable mention All-American as a sophomore and All-Region as a, as a junior, and she's being pushed by Megan Wren and sophomore and, and freshman Sarah Briggins. So, I mean, it goes all the way down the line. Well, we host we host Messiah on September 6th, sponsored by the President's Office. That's our first big home match, and we're really looking we're, we're really looking forward to it. Uh, we are so athletic and so entertaining and fun to watch, and our games are free. <laughs>